U.S. natural gas futures broke above the key $6.6 .6 level for the first time since December 2008, amid lingering worries about global energy supplies exuberated by the war in Ukraine against a growing demand backdrop. European Union countries agreed to ban coal imports from Russia, while pledged to start working on an embargo on Russian oil, gas and nuclear fuel, putting additional pressure on energy markets. Shipments of LNG to Europe are already at record levels, and the U.S. is facing significant pressure to help the continent secure further supplies. Fundamentally, cooler weekend weather trends helped strengthen the demand outlook in a market already concerned about supply availability. Weather models trended cooler, advertising stronger cooling for the eastern half of the United States over the next 10 to 12 days. It appears that a warmer trend may develop toward the very end of the month, which we would expect to persist into early May, given the continuation of the La Nina base state, something that should be a mainstay well into the summer season as well. Gas futures linked to TTF were trading near 100 euros per megawatt hour, a level not seen in two weeks, and roughly 70% down from its record peak reached in March as more LNG shipments and a warmer weather outlook offset concerns over a possible disruption in supplies. Russian state-owned gas producer Gazprom is supplying natural gas to Europe via Ukraine in line with requests from European consumers, it said in a statement on Sunday. Meanwhile, EU sanctions on Russian coal will only take effect in August, delaying the substitution by utilities to use oil and natural gas as feed for power generation.